On Google Earth, seeing the trace lines from the Pacific Ocean to the mountains Andes in South America. Have you ever wondered if Andes was pushed by something? Yes, we've been told it's part of plate tectonics movement. But today I'm going to show you the greatest discovery that will make you think otherwise. To explain these patterns on this planet, we can take two routes. One approach is thinking internal force comes within the planet. Or second approach, imagining external force applied by another object. Plate tectonics theory is the first approach. It's well established and accepted. Plate's movement is driven by internal mechanisms. Researchers agreed the force comes from within the planet itself. But what if the initial driving force originates from external objects? Here, let me show you a different route combining both approaches. I believe it will open up a totally different possibility. Let's zoom on the shoreline of South America, based on the slope and pattern from the top of the mountain to ocean. Apparently, we can feel forces acting on the shoreline mountain slopes. We can come up with a scenario where something pushing South America's shoreline from the Pacific Ocean side. There is force applied on top of the continent on the land, and the location of this force is one of the key points of this hypothesis. Let's focus on the region connecting Antarctica to Drake Passage. Apparently, it's the result of tearing motion. Antarctica shoreline been ripped and torn apart from west to east. The Drake Passage region, connecting Antarctica and South America, is a typical mud pattern when squeezed and popped. If we put these evidences together, this tearing pattern and following the trace lines from Zelendia to Antarctica, we can clearly come to a conclusion. A portion of Antarctica was sliced off from the bottom of Zelendia and been pushed and turned to the current location. Drake Passage was a result of pushing, squeezing, and popping events, then combined with the plate's separation red region. We can almost come up with a cracking event. On the prehistorical planet, Antarctica and Zelendia were connected together. Bottom of South America, west shoreline was connected with north of Antarctica. South America west side is located near the center location of the current Pacific. Something pushed on the surface of the prehistorical planet sliced Antarctica off from Zelendia, tore and pushed Antarctica and South America from west to east. In the end, Drake Passage was popped out. Are you following me? Did you come up with the same hypothesis as I did? I believe this will fundamentally change the way we think about our planet's history. If you are following my thinking so far, you may come up with the question, what on earth could it be that can push the continents, the plates of the planet, and move them in such a violent way? Click the next video on screen. I'll reverse the process further and show you more unbelievable findings.